you're going on a cruise, are you the type of person that will only stay in a balcony room? Let's quickly talk pros and cons of booking all of the room categories from interior to suite. So starting off with the least expensive cruise room that you're gonna find, it is the interior. And it's called the interior because literally you are on the inside of the ship. There are no windows in that room at all. There are definitely pros to this. If you're someone who likes to sleep in and you don't like the natural light coming into your room early in the morning, that interior might be for you. But on the flip side, for people who feel claustrophobic on a ship or it's your first cruise and you're nervous that you will feel claustrophobic on a ship, I probably wouldn't recommend an interior since there's really no way to even look outside. Now these rooms also, depending on the cruise line, could be a little bit smaller than the Ocean View balcony, definitely smaller than the suites. Next are Ocean View rooms. So these are basically interior rooms, but with a window. And the size of that window kind of depends on the room category and the ship you're going on. Um, but they can range from little tiny portholes to big, big windows. And on deluxe ocean views, you can even get like floor to ceiling beautiful windows. These are really nice if you're looking for some natural light or when you're approaching your port, you know, you wanna see outside. I also love in an ocean view that you could see the sunset right before you're getting ready for dinner. So little things like that. Next are the balconies. So these balcony rooms, depending on the cruise line, can be a little bit bigger than the interior or the ocean view rooms. And they include your own private balcony. I cannot overstate how nice it is to wake up in the morning and go on the balcony and sip your coffee. It's also really nice to have a glass of wine out there before dinner. And if you're going, on an Alaskan cruise, I'm gonna say that that balcony is gonna be a must have. I mean, when else in your life are you going to walk outside and see glaciers right outside of your room? And lastly, we have our suites. So suites are amazing because they are, first of all, super spacious. So I would say in any of the rooms I mentioned before, fitting more than two guests is a tight squeeze. Cruise rooms can be small, cruise bathrooms can be very small. Suites just give you that extra room to just like breathe along with a bigger balcony, which is so nice. But honestly, no matter which room you choose, you're on a cruise.